Okay, wow. we're talking we're talking about the incoming one, which are the Imperian models, the Imperian oh, I like that. Uh, yeah, you, you know, you know, wait, uh, yeah. from right to left, yes, 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 no, no, no. That's what I can say about this, <laughs> this set really? here. No, no, no. The, 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 the small things there, they look like, what did, what do they call them in Infinity? They don't look like you need to the, 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 yeah, the, 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 the squad, the squad. You mean the squad? Yeah, the squad looks... Derpy. Yeah. But that's 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 the reincarnation of Doctor Snake. So are you <laughs> Snake style? If they are, if they probably made them look taller, I, I guess I can make them. You can paint them to look like Protoss. The, the, yeah, the but yeah, right yeah, now yeah. they're derpy. Yes. Yeah. yeah, they're they're a bit hunched down. Yeah, not, not a fan. Otherwise, uh, the demon, the demon Jack looks looks pretty good for me. Plus the tentacle guys. Oh yeah, uh, definitely T tentacle all the way. Tentacles, yeah, all the way. Yeah, all the way. All the way. Oh, the small guys. Doji, Doji. Tentacle coming out of their head. Which one? Which uh, one? The, the small guys have tentacles coming out of their head. Yeah, but no. It is a really weird. It reminds me of that guy in Star Wars. Who's that guy in Star Wars? Is the Jabba the Hutt? The uh, Twilight, Twilight. Uh, yeah. 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 It does that. Twi'lek, a Twi'lek, sorry. Yeah. So here's another view. I guess, yeah, it's the bended knees. Maybe if you make them, like, stand taller, they would look better. Yeah, it, it, yeah it's pretty funny. I think the bended knees thing, is a, it's a motif of everything. Even the paladins, they have... The, with the, yeah, uh, yeah, with the jacks. Reverse the jointed. Jacks. They're reverse jointed. But yeah, that's, reverse that doesn't really excuse the, the way they look yeah. right now. They look like <laughs> balls with feet. They look yeah. like what? It's too chunky. <laughs> <laughs> and then the, the pose is so undynamic. And, I mean, yes, yeah. that is that's maybe one thing they still have to reach that infinity level. Even for the for for the for the jacks or in infinity, the tags wherein the tags can also have dynamic poses. I I, I don't know with the new tags now, but I think the new tags now they really have they very good better, actually. dynamic poses. Are, yeah. Are we talking about infinity? Infinity, yeah. Yeah, the but jacks those, those two on the upper, the I guess, like the left of the screen, the most unorganic sneak. Organic <laughs> sneak. <laughs> they look so static. <laughs> they pose for a for a sneak. But is that a face? Is that a face on the upper left side? Does it have a face painted on it? Or? No. It's, well, I don't oh, think so. It's, it's like I don't. A, yeah. It's a frowny face. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine if this uh the solo, the the leftmost would have its tentacles like extended. Yeah, out. yeah, yeah, exactly. Make it look yeah. really some something scary. Yeah. Well, but this is good for submarine style, because like a solo like that might be <laughs> it's, 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 it's nothing, it doesn't look scary, let's not bother it. <laughs> so obviously this is the pattern I backed for a uh, Kickstarter. <laughs> <laughs> I must confess, I already backed this, guys. <laughs> so did I. So did I. I, get, I got skirmish level also. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I also. This well, is the $490 one, right? I no, no, no. The no, skirmish is 160 No, not the skirmish, of course. <sighs> yeah, that's the full... What you're getting is not even full battle force. What you're The 400 one is the... One of everything, I think. That's one of everything. No, 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 no. I, I'm called the squads. There are like... Times three oh, yeah. or something, oh, and they have, like, they have the jacks, uh, something like that. Okay. So they're the ones to be released. They are activation efficient. Mm -hmm. They're also art efficient. Uh, for example, you can play a cipher card. If you play a cipher card, or if the opponent even targets your model with a cipher card, you can optional put an art on it. Ah, Less uh, that's, that's too confusing for IO. That's that's too complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Less planning. Less planning. Less planning. Uh, well, there. Or uh, I'm not really sure about this. Uh, I, I haven't really reviewed their stats too much, but they seem to be a toolbox. They have yeah, they a have lot, lot of everything. Pull. Yeah, they have access to all sorts of weapon traits. So if corrosion is to uh, Eternus <laughs> Continuum, fire is to Barter Worlds. I think they can arm. They have jacks that can have access to to all. Corrosion. All sorts of the, the traits. Yes, more tokens. <laughs> tokens. <laughs> Token army. Token for your opponent. Token for your opponent. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, you still have to buy your tokens, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Quads have high intensity weapons. So when you say high intensity, if you put an arc instead of a bonus, one power die, they get two. So that's right. across uh, all their squads. They also have access to a gate launcher, which is through oh, yeah. their video that's coming out. And when you play them, it sort of comes with you can do combo moves. Uh, when I <sighs> say I'm not sure if this is the top Imperium player because I'm I'm on Discord uh, with them. <laughs> But when he explained, he said that you can play in such a way that your Sentinel Heavy Warjack can activate all the time. And that is, uh, they said it's a strong Warjack. And the base ability is that Warjack can't be pushed or can't be displaced. So if it's on an objective, the only way to get it off is to probably kill it. Okay, and uh, this is in contest against the Eternus Continuum Weaver. Although this one is a shorter range, not like the Eternus Continuum, this one can cast the or can use your furies or your spells with rerolls and ignoring line of sight. Oh. <laughs> so, <is> that. <laughs> so, so that's what. So they so call it fury it. here. They call it fury here, not focus. Oh, no, so a fury, term? fury. Fury is the offensive spell. Ah, okay. So uh, all, all the cards are called ciphers, but the offensive ciphers are called furies. Okay. Okay. And they do also have repair support. They have the Doctor Worm. Doctor Worm. Doctor Worm. They have a doctor. Best uh, <laughs> dynamic. I think their the repair is the the dynamic uh, tentacles. Nice. So this is the Sentinel uh, Heavy Warjack that is coming out. Oh, wait, wait. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, Ayo, why, what made you choose that Imperian thing? Is it because it's the one available now? Or? Um, tentacles. Like my, like my favorite <laughs> Pokemon. It's, 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 tentacruel. <laughs> it's tentacruel. tentacruel. <laughs> so obviously when I, when I was actually, when I was talking to John, I, I told them I was going to pick Marcher Worlds because shooty. But then I read that they have lots of planning. <laughs> like, what's, what's the next best thing? And then I was looking at the Kickstarter and I saw the tentacles. And I'm like, mm, being a, a fan of anime. <clears throat> of anime. What kind of, uh, what kind of sentai, sentai, sentai. Super sentai. sentai super sentai. <laughs> super sentai anime. I think they made the right choice. <laughs> Well, I think yeah. Yeah, right now in Tabletop Simulator, Imperians, I think it's the top. They finished. Top what's, the, what's the lowest, lowest rank? <laughs> uh, below would be, I think, ISA. Pero sabi nila, what they said is, it's, I don't know, because of the, I'm sorry, the players, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but the, the top one Imperial, the Imperial player now, I think, was a former uh, ISA player. Then he shifted to Imperials. But then he is very experienced. So, so I don't know. He must have uh, watched anime. <laughs> well, what is it? Experience <laughs> was I mean, experienced Warcaster player. What, what does that mean? This game has been out for a few months, right? A few months, yeah. <laughs> a few months. Some people, they, they're, they're, they're lucky to play it face to face. But the one that is really being pushed right now is, is the tabletop simulator. That's where they get to test. That's why they get to play Imperians, even though Imperians are not released yet. And with our discussion on the Imperians, that rounds out our talk on getting into Warcaster. Are you ready to jump in? Join us in the next episode for the War Jeepney Hot Takes.